Certainly. Here's a more detailed breakdown. Cancer arises when genetic mutations occur within cells, disrupting the intricate balance between cell growth, division, and death. These mutations can be inherited from parents or acquired throughout life due to various factors. Exposure to carcinogens such as those found in tobacco smoke, asbestos, ultraviolet radiation, and industrial chemicals can damage DNA and increase the likelihood of mutations occurring. Moreover, environmental factors play a crucial role in cancer development. Air and water pollution, radiation exposure, and occupational hazards can all contribute to cellular damage and mutation. Additionally, lifestyle choices such as smoking, excessive alcohol consumption, unhealthy diet, and lack of physical activity can further elevate cancer risk by promoting chronic inflammation and oxidative stress in the body. Furthermore, certain infections such as hepatitis B and C viruses, human papillomavirus HPV, and Helicobacter pylori are linked to specific types of cancer. These infections can directly damage cells or trigger chronic inflammation, leading to genetic alterations that drive cancer progression. It's essential to recognize that cancer development is a multifaceted process influenced by a combination of genetic susceptibility, environmental exposures, and lifestyle factors. Understanding these interconnected causes is crucial for implementing effective prevention strategies, promoting early detection through screening programs, and developing targeted therapies to combat the disease at its roots.